Welcome to the 2015 NCHA World Finals. I'm here with the world champion of the $15,000 amateur division, Renee Primacing, who rode Malibu Max. Congratulations. Thank you very much. How does it feel to win that buckle? Oh, it's amazing. It's, it's my a dream come true for me. Is this your first major buckle? Um, yes, it is. So it's a special one then? Very special to me. Now, you came into this with a, a good size lead, um, but you could have been caught. So what was your game plan? Um, my game plan was to relax and enjoy the ride and whatever happened, happened. So you know, I, I worked hard, I practiced, um, we, I came here early and um, I practiced every day and wanted to be on my game and Max was awesome. Well, that commitment obviously won out for you. Describe your runs to us. Um, my first run was, I, I missed my first cut. I was trying to cut a certain cow. It wasn't lining up just right, and I panicked. But then I decided I am going to do my best on the next two cows, and I did. I, I fought it out, and I did a good job, and I left there feeling good about it. Well, that's a winning attitude. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't beat myself up about it. I just kind of shook it off and got back in there. And the next round? Um, I thought I did a great job on my first cow. Um, I cut the one that Monty, my trainer, wanted me to cut. It was a great cow. We really were going at it. Uh, perfect cow for Max. And my second cow um, was, was a tougher cow. And um, I ended up going over to the right. And um, I needed some herd help from Mike Woods and it kind of took me out of the money. But well, the rest of the run, I felt very good about. Yeah. And, and you've ended up victorious. So um, tell us about your horse, what you like about him. Um, Max has a lot of chrome. Um, he, he's very fancy, I think, in the show pen, and he's, he's an awesome horse. Um, he does his job, and he actually, my husband was the 2013 world champion in the 35,000 non-pro and um, he took care of him and he took care of me. What was it like living on the road and competing all year? Um, ups and downs. <laughs> you know I definitely had um, some downs and uh, my husband stood by my side the whole time and helped me through it since he had gone through this when he hauled he knew what it was like and he kept pushing me and encouraging me and that kept me going. You know, plus when you'd have a 74 or 75 run, that also keeps you going. Yeah, yeah. and it, it's important to have that support, isn't it? Yes, very much so. Makes all the difference. Thank you very much and congratulations once Thank again. Thank you. Thank you.